Hello guys, welcome back to Divine Time and Tarot. This is Tanya. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Cross watchers, you're always welcome. Good morning, good afternoon, Divine Time and Tarot family. I love you guys. I thank you. I truly appreciate you. Welcome, 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 new subscribers. Um we're here doing a general reading for Virgo. This is for November 2021. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Virgo, I've already shuffled sage, prayed over your cards. Getting you an overall energy here. Um, wow, Virgo. There's an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, that is feeling some kind of way here. Heartbroken? They, they're they mentally stuck? Some of them, I mean, are, I mean when I say they, it, this could be you or the other, other, other person. Somebody's in their head about somebody, but it's time to release something here. It's time to release something here. Somebody is mentally, someone's in their mentals, big time, big time. Somebody either could be low-key depressed. Somebody wants to communicate, and it's a burden that they can't communicate here. Somebody's burdened by not able to communicate, I see you looking very stable, grounded, looking good, working hard, working really hard. Mm, yeah, someone's definitely thinking about you. But whoever this person is, they're very manipulative. They like to play mind games. They do. They, yep, the magician. Very manipulative. This person is very manipulative. They love playing with your emotions. And they love playing with you too. They're very passionate about you. This person wants to have sex with you like today. Okay? Like today. All you got to do is say the word and they they there. They are there on, on the spot. Johnny on the spot. Yeah. This person is still holding on to you. Knight of Wands. There it is. I told you they want it now today. Somebody want to get with you today, okay? Oh, my God. What? Virgo, what's going on with y'all? What y'all doing? Y'all done put it on somebody they can't let it go. That's all they think about, y'all. Ooh-wee. Mm -hmm. This person is confused. I hope this ain't y'all, but I don't think this is y'all energy. Y'all, like, in the Nine of Pentacles energy, in your energy, standing in your power. Looking good, smelling good, you know, getting attention. But somebody here is confused. Somebody's confused. They don't. Somebody got one foot in, one foot out. Somebody in your past. Be aware of your own emotions, Virgo, okay? Be aware of your own emotions. Hmm. Wow. Okay. Give me some more information. What is the situation here? What is the situation here with Virgo? What is the situation here with Virgo? Uh, okay. We got the tower here. Change your life. This is the tower. A sudden revelation that offers freedom. Break free of procrastination. Embrace the opportunities that change brings. And we have the hangman here. Um, there's a better way. Pause for reflection and insight. Dare to be different. So it's like some of you guys have been enlightened about a situation. You're getting a different perspective on things. You, you, you had a sudden revelation. The eight of swords. Or this could be the person that is thinking about you. This air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. 
You have the Nine of Cups here. Make a wish. Dreams become reality. A joyful time of life. I get that you're focused on you right now. This is what I'm getting. This is your energy. This Nine of Cups. This is I'm loving me. But someone else is here like, whoa, regrets. They got regrets here. Your intuition is on fleet at this time. Okay, you could be, you're going to get some good news about some money. This could be another job. This could be a new project. This is an excellent opportunity will be offered to you. Divine guidance. And you got the Ten of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck here. That's abundance. That's financial security. The star. Oh, wow. You got two. You got the Nine of Cups here and the star card here. These are two wish cards. A dream come true. Believe in yourself. The end of a difficult situation. Your money is about to be really good. Also could be a um wow it's on the tip of my tongue. Money is coming in. Money is gonna be coming in for you. There's definitely financial success and the promise of retirement. Huh. There's a decision here that you're gonna have to make. It will all be better if you just make a decision. Somebody's overanalyzing something with you. Going back to this air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This star card, this is hoping and wishing and praying too. Somebody want to communicate with you like, bad, Virgo. The Six of Pentacles, material needs. You got a lot of money here. I see money. This, The Six of Pentacles, this is an equal give and take. This is material needs get fulfilled in magical and unexpected ways. So you're going to get some unexpected income. Um, I hate to say this. I don't know if I should say it, but it, obviously it's coming to me. Universe is bringing it to my attention. Some of you guys are going to be getting, um, there's going to be, someone's going to leave you some money. Someone that's going to be passing over is going to be inheritance. You're going to be getting an inheritance. That's for somebody, not for everybody. What else does Virgo need to know here, guys? Hey, Virgo, you got, wow, stability. Look at this, four wands. Stability. This is, could, this is all could, could be about, you know, celebration. We are going into the holidays. Um, this is rewards for hard work. Release yourself from burdensome situations. Anything that's bugging you, anything or anybody that has you in your mentals, move away from that individual. You need to have nothing but positive energy around you because you are manifesting. You are in manifest mode big time. Virgo, big time. Six of Cups. Somebody in your past cannot let you go. Even if they not saying nothing to you. Because they struggling to even try to communicate with you. You on this person's mind all the time. Okay? Just letting you know. This person's so confused. They don't know what to do. They don't know what to do. Mm, mm, mm. Wow. What else we got here for Virgo? Yeah, Page of Cups, Apology. Someone is definitely sitting back admiring you. You could have a secret admirer here. Um, some of y'all could have started a new, a, a, a little new emotional situation. I got Apology here. Someone wants to apologize to you. And that's just so they can get close to you, okay? <laughs> they want to get close to you so bad. 
But you in this, you like I said, you in in this, you in this selfish mode, as you should, as far as taking care of you, focused on you, your money, so on and so forth, your stability. This is where you at. You're no longer having things in your life that don't serve you. You're you're you're, you're over that. So you're over that, and they know that. That's why it's hard for them to come for you, to come towards you. Three of Cups. They definitely wants to reunite with you. Mm hmm. I'm also here, y'all, and I don't know where this is coming from. My guys be sometimes they be tripping, they be tripping sometimes. Somebody want a third party with you. Somebody want a menage, whatever y'all call it. When they, when three all everybody get together, everybody let's just everybody get together since. Ooh, y'all. Ooh, 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 ooh. OMG. OMG. Somebody, like I told y'all, somebody loves somebody and somebody is in love with somebody. And guess what, y'all? They want all of y'all to get together. Ooh. And guess what else I heard? The other person would go along with it but will you go along with it virgo they worried about you they ain't worried about the other person they worried about you virgo y'all uh-uh i'm getting out of this energy i don't know what y'all Ooh, and you, is you gonna think about it is you gonna think about it virgo are you gonna think about it <laughs> i hear hell to the no <laughs> Somebody better kick rocks. Somebody better kick rocks because no and no and I said hell no. Somebody is like, if you don't get out of my face with that BS, what? Y'all, that's what I'm hearing. I'm just I told y'all sometimes my guys be they, they be tripping. But yeah. Ooh wee. <laughs> I'm not laughing at y'all. I'm not. I'm laughing at this stupid individual that think that y'all might, you know, go there with them. The lovers. Look, the lovers. Somebody, a big decision between two people that somebody in love with. Yeah. Uh-huh. The lovers. Could be a Gemini. Could be a Gemini. Y'all know them Gemini is kind of freaky diggy. Uh-huh. Yup. I don't know, y'all. <laughs> I Hey, I'm just a reader here. That was crazy business, what I just heard. Oh, hell no. <laughs> oh, what other information does Virgo need to know? Positive movement forward. Yeah, you, you, you kicking rocks. You like, dude, for real, for real. Yeah, you moving fast. You moving, you moving forward very quickly here. There's going to be some passionate communication coming in. Definitely some passionate communication. Somebody gonna get up the balls to even ask you what was just said here. I think somebody gonna get the balls. You gonna be out. You go. <laughs> you gonna be like, Lord, what? Why? <laughs> y'all don't know why I'm acting like this, but some of y'all about to go through this little craziness right now. Okay. Uh-huh. Transformation. And some of you guys are definitely going through a transformation. And look what's underneath this. The seven of the seven of swords. Deception and envy. Uh-huh. A liar, a cheater. Somebody that's wanting to, de to, to deceive you. The will of fortune. I thought I saw the will of fortune earlier. I don't know, but um cancer had this twice in their video. Maybe you guys could be dealing with a cancer. Mm-hmm. And then we have new beginnings. You got the Wheel of Fortune here too. Something is definitely going to go in your favor. But you're cutting things out that don't serve you. All that little craziness that somebody's going to probably try to bring to you, you ain't going for that shit. You too mature for that. You the Queen of Swords. You feel me? Queen of Swords don't play with nobody. She done been through a lot. And she ain't got time to be playing no 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 game. She ain't playing no game with nobody. Not at all. Give me one more card and we'll get an outcome here for for go. The a spiritual union, the two of cups. 
someone feels that they that, that you and them are on the same page, <laughs> that y'all on the same page. This could also be a new person that's coming for you. This could be this person. Somebody's admiring you. You have a secret admirer that you know nothing about. And they, and they have not come forth yet. Conflict and defeat. The five of swords. This is that air sign. <laughs> yeah, the empress. There you are. You're standing in your power. Definitely. You ain't going for no BS with nobody. Nobody. Nope. Nope. You know your worth. You know your worth, and you definitely standing in your power. You ain't got time for that craziness. <laughs> oh my God! Look, the two of cups again. Y'all got somebody. Y'all, y'all got a soulmate coming in. Y'all got a soulmate coming in towards you. Mm-hmm. Just be patient. Be patient. Don't get all nothing. I ain't saying that. I'm not. No. Mm -mm. <laughs> I'm not going to say that. Uh, what's the outcome here for Virgo? Guides, no. What is the outcome here for Virgo? God, angels, ancestors, Holy Spirit. Yeah, something is over. Ten of swords, you're done with something, somebody. They betrayed you. They, they, they ain't getting another chance to betray you ever. We have the will of fortune again. Things are definitely going to go in your favor. Something here is destined. I'm hearing you've learned your lessons, period. You're, in the, you're at the end of a difficult situation. The worst is over. The worst is over. Oh, shit. You got somebody coming in towards you. I'm done telling you. That air sign. You got an air sign here that's kind of goofy. Could be somebody that you work with. Eight of Pentacles. What the hell? What the hell? But the death card is here. Something is over. This person does want to communicate with you, but you're just like, you're done with that. You've learned your lessons with this individual. You have learned your lessons with this individual. You're not giving them any more. They are not going to get any more of your time, period. Period. And this might be this drama. <laughs> what we were talking about earlier, this might be the shit they're going to be trying to talk to you about. You're going to be like, what the? Okay. What's uh, advice? Give me some advice. What is the advice here for Virgo? I like this reading. I do. <laughs> but y'all, y'all good. Y'all in y'all power. Y'all, y'all on the right path. Um, there's a lot of prosperity, abundance coming in for you. So, you know, just, you know, keep doing what you're doing right now. Okay. And, and don't worry about all this other craziness. Because as far as I'm concerned, you guys are cutting things out that don't serve you. You're not going. You're moving forward. You're moving forward. You know, you feel me? You got your back turned to this drama, whatever it is. You're working hard. You're focused on your coin. You are focused on your coin. Chariot, move, keep moving forward. Yeah, this is advice from universe. Yeah. Some of you guys are going to be traveling. The Knight of Cups. This is somebody that wants to come in and sweep you off your feet. This is this person that's, that's really um, checking you out. It could also be somebody at your job, too, that's checking you out. And the Seven of Pentacles. Somebody definitely wants to invest in you. Wow. I like Nine of swords at the bottom of the deck. That air sign, I don't know what to tell y'all about that person. I just don't know what to say about them. They got they got secret love for you. That's for damn sure. Secret love. Mm -hmm. They ain't expressing it because... Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Because they, mm, they ain't right. They not right. That's why they can't come forth. Because they ain't right. They on some bullshit. Mm-hmm. <laughs> So, Virgo, this is what I got for you guys. Just keep it moving. Just keep it moving. You're, you, hey, you're on the right path. Don't let nothing bother you. Don't let nothing bother you. Just keep it pushing. Because what you, what, you're working on something, and something is definitely coming for you. 
prosperity, abundance. Everything is going to work out in your favor, okay? So, Virgo, this is what I have for you. If it resonates, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.